The Islamic invasion of Europe has had a tremendous negative impact on the continent, especially in the skyrocketing crime wave and rape epidemic. Regardless, Barack I is still bringing in Islamic migrants and shipping them all over the U.S., which brings us to a story about rape that's sure to anger you. Three Islamic migrants from two different families kidnapped and raped a little girl at knife point. Stories like this are routine in places like Germany and Sweden, but this rape occurred in Twin Falls, Idaho. And what's even more bizarre is the fact that the rapists were only 13, 10, and 8 years old, with the 13-year-old directing the younger two in the sexual assault. The girl was playing outside around the Fawnbrook apartment buildings where she lived when she was approached by the three young Syrian refugees. One of the boys put a knife to her throat and forced her inside a nearby laundry room where she was then stripped naked and raped. When the younger boys were unable to ejaculate, the 13-year-old told them to urinate on her. The entire sexual assault was captured on video on the 13-year-old's cell phone. The girl's grandmother found her and notified her mother who called the police. Because of a language barrier, the police were unable to do much, even with the video from the cell phone as evidence. It was reported that one of the mothers of the assailants just kept repeating the words, no police, and the mother of the victim witnessed the father of the 13-year-old high-five his son. The sexual assault took place on June 2nd, but so far has been completely ignored by the national mainstream media. During a Twin City Falls Council meeting, you can clearly hear the anger of residents demanding to know why the council has failed to address the rape as well as other crimes committed by local Islamic migrants like hit-and-run incidents and Muslims spitting on non-Muslims. The council chalked up their concerns to Islamophobia and even white supremacism. So apparently, the city council of Twin Falls, Idaho is too busy drowning in political correctness to make the local American citizens a priority or even address the rape of this little girl. Are you angry yet, folks? Arm yourselves and prepare for more of this Islamic violence. Obama's fundamental transformation of America is upon us. Thanks for listening. Don't forget to subscribe and donate at theraywarnershow.com.